I'm Amanda Strama, I'm Olivia's mom. Olivia had a heart transplant when she was seven and a half months old. Everything happened so quick that, uh, you know, at the time, I don't think we really had time to process exactly what was happening. I didn't eat a lot and my body wasn't really healthy. She had acute dilated cardiomyopathy and her body had been compensating for that, which is why she didn't seem sick at all. So it came out of left field. We did not know that she was sick at all. Within an hour of her being at Johns Hopkins, she went into cardiac arrest. It's a very big machine that kept her alive for two days. And they put her on the list on, a, on I believe, Thursday morning. And within 12 hours, they told us that they had found the match. Um, I'm pretty sure that was a Hopkins record, at least at that time. It's hard with anybody, but it's very hard with children when you know that there's a small child out there that somebody is grieving. And if I could meet the donor family, I would say thank you. And I don't know what else is big enough to thank somebody for giving you your child back. practice ballet, jazz, and tap, all of them, and it's really fun. I really do like swimming. I might get back in there, and I'm on level four. I um, obviously love and support the act of organ donation. Uh, I think everyone should be a donor, and it's it's pretty much the most amazing thing you know you can think of that someone else can selflessly save someone else's life. My mom says that she won the lottery twice because she had me and she got me again because I had a heart transplant.